Our business is about people. And my view of that is I care about people. We've just repositioned our hotel in Muscat. Um, we have a sort of three in one hotel concept there in Muscat. But we've taken our premium brand there, the Al Hassan Hotel, and we've rebranded that as a separate entity. Uh, yeah, we've, we've got uh, two immediately coming up, uh, one in uh, Jeddah, which should open at the end of 2019, early 2020, superb uh, hotel on the Corniche. We also have a hotel uh, opening in uh, Bahrain, that'll probably be 2021, um, another great project, it's right on the marina, um, and it has, uh, it's a really integrated complex with service apartments, a marina, retail uh, and a beautiful hotel. We, we hope to really develop much more in the Middle East. We see great potential probably in Dubai to expand even further. Um, Saudi Arabia, we're looking at projects in uh, Riyadh and Mecca that we hope to you know, sign up in the near future. But we do see big potential here. And we see big potential in, in North Africa as well. For us, a lot of our focus has been on the redevelopment in the company, uh, reorganization of the, of the group. Uh, and um, we're pushing hard to restructure our, our, the, the, the dynamics of Shangri-La. Um, we set up the, the Dubai hub here uh, about two years ago with a view to growing in this region. Uh, and. Um, you know, there's a lot of a lot of things happening around that event, um, but I think internally, in terms of new development, um, our app has just come online, the Shangri-La app, uh, and we've we've actually designed it internally within the company. I think it's in itself quite exciting. We haven't gone out to third-party vendors. Uh, it's a super app. Uh, we're doing likewise with our website at the moment. Um, so we're trying to harness the youth of the organization. Um, we've got some great young tech kids who are working on these, these new um, exciting uh, IT um, aspects. And I think the app is already out there and is, we're hoping to have a million hits by the end of the year. Our business is about people. And my view of that is I care about people. And, and if anything has kept me in this business and still keeps me in the business, is, is my care for people. So whether it be the guest um, or the people that work with me and for me, uh, I think they, they drive our industry. We're, we're in a hospitality business. Um, and I think uh, I've come up from pretty humble surroundings. Um, I've worked my way through the business all the years. I've done most jobs that people do in our industry. Uh, and I've uh, worked with some great colleagues uh, through, through my years and I think because I care about them, because um, I worry about the development, probably being my biggest pride that I have uh, as I work day to day is really in other people's success and I think if you can um, enjoy the business because of the people around you, that'll make you a successful leader. We've got a target of tripling the size of the company over the next uh, three to five years. So we, we've got ambitious uh, plans. Um, uh, I think there's a lot more involved in it than, than that. Uh, we're also actively restructuring uh, a lot of the way we work. Um, the, the world is changing around us and the dynamics are changing very fast. Uh, I, I think that the whole advent of technology, um, of disruption around us is changing our industry as well. So we're, we're adapting on one side the, the way we operate as an organization. Um, we're looking at our brands in, in a sense, should we have more brands as Shang or just a Shangri-La hotel brand? Uh, and that's something that's really being worked on at the moment. Uh, but our, our real desire is to grow the company, to really be uh, you know, the best and most uh, recognized Asian hotel brand in the world. Uh, I think we're pretty close to that now. We have some superb products, um, but I think we'd like to stretch the company a little bit further. We need, need to be a little bit more of a world player. Uh, we've been traditionally more of a niche player, uh, particularly around Asia, but we see ourselves growing outside of that. We see Middle East, uh, Africa as being exciting destinations, Europe. Um, we've got hotels in London and Paris and Istanbul, but 
we also see lots of opportunity to develop the company further um, through these regions. Uh, so, yeah, I, th I think uh, growth would be very high on our, our list of uh, major priorities.